Today is Thursday, the 22nd of July, the year 2021. It's about 10 a.m. I'm documenting vandalism. My locker that I bought, I woke up today, somebody broke off the hasp that goes to this. You can see my lock is still engaged. I'm a victim of gain stalking. My stalkers come in, break things, cut things. So I know that the police aren't gonna help me, but I just wanted to document some information. Um, let me show you one other thing. Hold on, I'm gonna put you on pause. So they, uh, I came home, was in my bathroom, and I have this, it's, it's garland, it's fake garland, and somebody had come in and cut it. Okay, so I was going to stop doing videos because I felt like they were unproductive and mostly it just exposes, you know, how well our stalkers are doing. And, um, yeah, they're... They're collecting all your videos, making a little folder on what, what they've done and how well they've done it. So originally I started making these videos because I thought I could help people, but I didn't think that far ahead. I deeply regret ever starting this, but there's a necessity to document violence, acts of violence. And so I'm doing this today and I bring it to all of you who are going through the same thing. I, have, I get threats every day, every day, you know, every single day from the stalkers, from the gang stalkers, from this criminal network. And, the, you know, you ignore the threats. There's nothing you can do, but mostly it's about, you know, taking everything I own type of thing. And I just want to be at peace about all of this. We know that these are challenges to our faith. It, it works out the quality of our faith. And I think that based on your faith, I guess the health of your faith, they're going to target you to see if they can break you down. They see your weaknesses. I am not materialistic. I have had to move several times because of the stalkers. I've had to dump my life, got rid of so many beautiful things I wish I had. So materialism isn't the thing, but somehow materialism seems to be, it seems to be the focal thing for the most recent activity of these thugs. Um, I'm just wondering, has anybody else figured out how to deal with it? And I want to remind people that they target you based on your faith. What's the quality of your faith? Remember, the scripture talks about not your works that Jesus would present after it's all over, but thing that something that's more more valuable than gold, your faith. That's what he'll present to our grand creator, Jehovah God. So I don't know. This morning, I guess it, it kind of caught me off guard when I reached for the cabinet to try to unlock it to get to some things. And I saw that it was broken. So, targeted individuals, what are, we, what are you doing about this? I mean, is there anybody else out there? And just so you understand, I know that my account is shadow banned. So that means they're able to manipulate who can comment, who cannot comment. And I know there are a majority of people probably are the thugs in the criminal network, but if somebody can get through and offer a beneficial comment, or if you haven't been commenting, it'd be great to hear from you, to, you know, how you've been managing this part, if this is something you're doing. And um, I wanna remind you, don't help them. Don't make videos that helps them document how well they're doing. Seems like I'm contradicting myself, I'm not. I need to document this one episode because every it's it continues to happen and I want some evidence to be out there for whatever it's worth.
So may God's peace be with you today and stay strong.